Hey guys, how's everybody doing today? I'm heading out on a train to Stirling, Scotland. There is an awesome castle I want to check out in an old town. And it just looks beautiful, the architecture, everything. And I'm sure it has a lot of history. So I'm excited to explore it. I'm on my way to catch a train. So I'll see you guys there. right up against the wall right now up to the castle look at this guy now this is a stunning view When I was reading up about it on Wikipedia, it said that they had English, French, and German architecture. With Stirling, it was actually the capital of Scotland before. Before Edinburgh. Yeah, I didn't know that either. That's why it's so lavish in here. <laughs> Pretty solid. Walkways everywhere. This must be his desk. This is a very steep stairs. This castle's like a maze. We're trying to find all these the rooms and we don't know how to get there. I don't know, I kind of like this castle more than Edinburgh Castle. It just didn't seem very, uh... So this is the Great Hall. See how far down it goes. Wow. It's a very good defensive position from here. It's yeah. pretty... I could see why they built the castle here. Yeah. Well, here are the cannons. I mean, they would go a long, long ways. There's another maze here. Powder magazine. Yeah. Smells really old and must it musty. Does. It's kind of cool though. Probably gotta do everything they could to keep this thing completely dry. Yeah, it this makes sense how they, yeah. how they separated this building from everything else in case it blows up. <laughs> so lucky with the weather today, guys. Yeah. It's perfect. I'm glad I came here because I wasn't even like, I was debating about whether I should go or not go. Honestly, this is the best part of my trip, I think, yeah. Oh. yeah so it's mostly because we're here though, right? Yeah. yeah, and I didn't introduce them earlier. This is Zach and Mary yeah, from Iowa and Minnesota. Yep. So we're here exploring Sterling. So now we're just gonna head back to the town and get some food because we're starving. Walk into the Church of the Holy Rood, yep. which I think is the oldest building in Sterling. Reading up about it right now and this church dates back to the 15th century. I love visiting churches and especially if they're really old. They have a lot of character and architecture. I guess we're getting food now. I'm gonna get this and then that is an appetizer. the 
bridge, finally. Took a long walk. We're going the right direction. Look how far the castle is. All the way up there. Yeah, this is the River Forth. Same river that flows uh, through Edinburgh. Definitely a cool looking bridge. It was built in like the 13th century, so. Back up we go. I didn't expect to see German architecture here. Hello, I'll take this one. I had to get some local candy. Candy's really, really good. I'm glad I got some local food. We're heading back to the train station now. I think we're all going back to Glasgow, right? My Fitbit just buzzed. We walked like eight or nine miles. Oh, Today was a successful day. Successful day. Successful. Absolutely. We saw a lot. Made new friends. Made yeah. new friends. A lot, of, a lot of history lessons learned. I'm glad I went on this old day trip. Yeah. And you guys are off to Edinburgh tomorrow. Yep. Yeah. yeah. And I'm flying home. So, yeah, this kind of ends my trip. Are these the dungeons? Probably a dead end. <laughs> no pun intended. For somebody. <laughs>